Hey, this is Ryan from Learning Wars for Kids, and today we're going to be playing the game Park and Passion. I'm just going to be showing you guys the basics of the game and show you what things skills can be used while playing this game. Okay, so we're going to click level 1, and I'll show you the basics really quick. So you control this red car that it gives you, and the main objective is just to get to the parking space before the time runs out. This level is really easy, the parking space is right in front of you, so you just pull up and park your car. The way you control your car is the either you can click these buttons um, on your screen or you can use the arrow keys, which I strongly prefer to use the arrow keys. Um, if you're not sure where to go, follow the arrow on your on the top of the screen up there and it will show you where the parking spot is and next to it is how much time you have. The times go the times get uh, smaller and smaller as you actually go through the levels and the parking jobs get harder and harder. So you really need to be using time management when you're playing this game. You need to be watching the amount of time you have and thinking about that when you're parking your car. Just as you can see, I've only played three levels, but the parking jobs are getting a little harder and harder and I just need to keep, um, stay calm and just work till I have it. And this is the next level, level four. Um, yeah, you're gonna realize that now there's traffic and the parking spots get harder and harder, so you really need to be using self-control as well. Um, if you hit a car, don't freak out. If you have to restart the level, don't freak out. Just try at it again and don't worry. Remain calm as you're going through and take your time. There's no need to, to freak out and really just rush yourself. Just take your time and you will get it done eventually. Yeah, and the thinking skills that you use in this game can be used in your everyday life as well. Just like as if you were getting ready to go to school, you really need to watch your time or you're gonna end up missing the bus. And if you miss the bus, you really can't freak out. You can always get someone to give you a ride or, and, and it's the same exact thing like in this game. If, if you miss the parking spot on the first try or you end up hitting a car, you can always try again and there's always ways around it. So don't worry too much and have fun playing. Yeah, this has been um, Park Passion. Hope you guys have fun playing and see you guys next time.